chives, pork. I didn't use all the pork. I still have a little bit left because I didn't really know the ratio. The ratio. Okay. I just oh, this is a big bowl. Uh, I just kind of go with my feeding. I don't know how much dough I have. It's just rising. It looks the same, uh, but now I'm gonna put in one egg as a combining agent, right? Shake, <laughs> shake. Oh. oh, it's so pretty. We got red, green, and yellow. It's like the traffic light. So the noodle has expanded. They become very, ooh, all the, all the steam. They became very soft and fatter. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna pour these, well not pour, I'm just gonna fish these noodles out into the stuffing. And um, I used to chop them on the cutting board, but they become, um, the chopping board become very liquidy because all the water just kind of goes everywhere. So now I learned that I'm just gonna fish these out. Actually, I'm gonna save the wood here. I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna chop the wood here. Okay, let's put this in this little bowl. I'm gonna fish out the wood here, but I'm, I'm gonna get the noodles out from this pot into a stuffing like this. Ooh. I think I forgot one key um, ingredient, but I'll get to that later. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, uh, Baba. Mm. I, I just fished all the noodles out and I got the wood airs right here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna cut them into smaller pieces and put them, mix them into my stuffing. These are decent size. The color is so beautiful. Alright, in here I have some sliced ginger and a whole garlic. I'm going to turn the blender on. smoothie <laughs> ginger garlic flavor smoothie what's up okay now i'm gonna season the stuffing so in here i've got um some chopped up chinese wood air bean thread noodle i still have to cut them using a scissor uh, grounded pork and these are chives and a uh, raw egg um okay let's do some soy sauce just go with the flow, okay. <laughs> we don't measure anything, okay. Some salt, okay. Um, a thing of oyster sauce. I think that should be good. These stuff are, these thing is pretty strong, oyster. I don't know if there's any oyster in there. Um, oh. Dark soy sauce, dark soy sauce. It's for coloring. Okay, I think that's a little too much, but oh well. Ooh, and our secret ingredient is uh, oh, it's brand new. I think my dad just went out to get some yesterday. Uh, it's like the bouillon, bouillon cube. Do a little bit in here. Our chicken is called oh, tasty mushroom flavor. Okay, it's the granulated mushroom bouillon. 
Bullio. <laughs> That's a word. Yes. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's too much. Okay. Now, I'm going to need to use my scissor. One sec. Alright, because I didn't pre-cut the, the glass noodle, so they're like the length of a spaghetti noodle. That's pretty long. So I'm going to cut them using a scissor because I'm too lazy to chop them on the chop, chopping board. I love using scissors. See? Less mass. Uh. Oh. Ooh. Jesus. I got some nice color. Some good color in here, guys. I can cut them up while mixing them. Two. Ah. Uh, two bird, one stone. I love this bowl. I don't know we have such a large bowl. It was hidden on the bottom shelf. Okay. My arm is getting tired. I'm going to use my left hand. It's just not, uh, not very comfortable with my left hand. Oh, look at Look. Look. One sec. This is what I'm doing right now. Oh, I forgot some sesame oil. Sesame oil. A bit more. <laughs> oh, it smells really nice. I'm gonna do a bit swirling. <laughs> Should be fun. <laughs> okay, I think that's enough cup tang. I'm gonna. Hi hey guys, I wish you can smell this. It smells really nice. Mm. Ah, I know, even everything here is raw beside those scratch noodles. Oh. Oh, it smells really nice. I just ate, but I'm getting hungry again. Also, I wonder what this is for. This is the water uh, mixed. This is the ginger and garlic water that I just blended. And I'm going to pour them in little by little. Just. Okay. So this really adds flavor to your stuffing. I learned it from a, like, quote unquote culinary school, culinary school. Uh, in my hometown, Kaifeng in China. They specialize uh, teaching like those little, um, little food item you can purchase on the, like street food, okay? And the, the teacher taught us the secret or making your stuffing tastier is to add in this ginger garlic water it gives that's where the juicy the, the, the juicy besides from the, the 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 meat and also from this secret ginger garlic water <laughs> okay i probably need a part three of this video because i'm not even halfway i have not even started making the buns yet Oh, I'm gonna take my time and have fun. Hopefully by lunchtime we'll, we'll have uh, our steamed, either steamed or pan-fried pork bun. Yeah. 